Any restaurant along the beach is generally popular most of the time, and Jake's Del Mar is no exception. They have a great oceanfront view, which is what prompted the eater's trip there. Most seating in the restaurant has a view to the ocean, with some seating out on the patio. Because of its popularity, however, you may have trouble finding a place to park. Their lot is jammed, and you may have to park in the sand across the street. Once seated, the waiter will recite an unbelievably long list of specials. It seems impossible to remember all six specials, names, descriptions, and prices, without having them written down. I didn't order any specials. I didn't want to go back over the list again. The menu is certainly adequate. It's small, but a fair choice from hamburgers to steak and lobster. And they do have a decent wine list to go along with that. The eater chose the steak filet at $12.95. The baked potato and salad were extra. The steak was cooked in a bacon strip. I'd have preferred it without it. It was a little undercooked for my taste, but all in all, it wasn't a bad piece of meat. The salad had a great tarragon house dressing. My guest had New York steak, which was excellent. It came with a rice pilaf, but the rice had a strong herbal aftertaste. We shared an order of heart of palms. They are rare around here and uniquely good. For dessert, we had the chocolate mousse. It comes in a glass with whipped cream topping. Gets an okay rating from me. The prices aren't out of line for a beachfront restaurant, and you'll find it has a comfortable atmosphere with pretty good food. For News 8, this is The Unknown Eater.